kind of delve into the something that sounds absolutely atrocious? Yes. yes. Sour Punch, Scorching Straws. I'll try one. I'm probably going to die, but I'll try it. Or it's immediately One, died. two, three. Ah. Oh, God. I hate you. <laughs> no. Yours. That's bad. Okay. All right. Hello, everybody. We're in the vents. Hello. We've, we've um we've eaten sour patch stuff. Maybe I threw some of that in there. I don't know. Um, no. Uh, what? No. We're stuck. Oh, gotcha. Oh, God. My mouth is actually on fire. Okay, the orange one you lied is so much worse than any of the others. <laughs> really? The the uh... the lime one was actually maybe worse than this, or about the same. You um, read. The lime? Lime was worst. Lime was Why horrible. is that not work? Okay, it worked. Yeah, it worked. You good job. You run through. Thanks, buddy. Oh, no. I'm sorry if I'm breathing heavily, but we got to get these done, and just because my mouth is on fire doesn't mean... Oh, God, run away. Run away. Run away. Run away. Run away. She's coming. She's coming. She's coming. Run, 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 run. I'm going as fast as I can, bro. Oh, that's a shame. That's a shame. She killed me. You died. I turned as quick as I could. Well, yeah, you turned as quick as you could on a controller. <laughs> you were caught by Molly McCaw. Oh. Damn. Molly can repeat words that she's heard. Don't be fooled. Press E to respawn. There you go, bud. I got you. <sighs> do you think <sighs> it said I hesitated looking at her open the thing? Yes. Yeah, I do. Okay, so I gotta go up here. Although, I think it's also because you're on controller, and this game is not made for controller. You're fine, you go. Fine. Maybe I will. You're gonna talk shit. <laughs> Fine. All right, this should be fun. What the? <laughs> the sensitivity. <laughs> Whoa. Press escape. Oh, that's what's ha that's why it's inverted normally. Okay. Why is inverted now for mouse? Yeah, it is. Um, oh, that's dumb. Invert horizontal off. Invert no, and then eight. <laughs> is the sensitivity insane on mouse? Oh my god! I couldn't. I that that I was barely moving Better now. Slightly. Um, you can adjust it more if you need. No, I'm good. All right, let's do this fucking. Let's do this shit. Let's go. Bring it, Molly. Fucking time to go. Oh wait, hold on. I gotta get. <laughs> what are you waddle, doing? Waddle, 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 waddle. I wanted to get like a good shot of her waddling. All right. You gotta, you gotta, gotta get that thumbnail. You gotta get the thumbnails, you know. <clears throat> do you want to set the controller on that, by the way, just so that we don't actually kick it off? Oh yeah, I can do that. I don't want to. You know, I can. Those I can, are nice I can put it on the ground. She can repeat words that she's heard. Don't be fooled. Has she talked? She might have. I feel like she just garbles. Nope. Up the thing first. Uh, up the thing. Oh, this thing. Yes. I got you. I got you. All right. An E, I think. Yeah, probably. There you go. Yeah. I like the little steam achievement noise it makes. Yeah, a little bloop. All right, now we can turn Yes, now I'll turn around and just run. Third time's the charm, everybody. Hi, Molly. Okay, let's go. Going, 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 going. Don't know where I am. I do fucking God. <laughs> <laughs> fucking lag. Did you see that? Yes. It like rubber banded and shot you forward. <laughs> Into Molly. That's bullshit. That is absolute bullshit. I'm calling skill issue. Okay. I mean, a little bit, yeah, sure. Yeah, feels. I mean... I mean, y'all both suck. I'm not passing this off. Because I know I suck. And I'm willing to take that criticism. Oh, you should. I am way too warm right now to play. So. Oh, really? Oh, good for you. All right, I'm ready. I'm ready, Molly. Episode Let's... four is just wild right now. Ah, uh, my mouth is finally cooling down, though. Let's go. Let's I fucking... Know. My stomach hurts after it, though. And I only had a half of one. Keep it going. Keep it going. Molly's angry. I don't know what I did to upset her, but... You existed. She's not happy with me. That's for fucking yeah, sure. Something. Oh, did I miss it? Did nope. I fuck it? This Good thing. job. Left. Left. Yep, you got it, you got it. Molly knows By the way. The way. Who called that there would be a chase scene. Yeah, you're right. You gotta have a chase scene in these indie mascot horrors. Honestly, I dig this one though. This one's pretty fun. I fucked it. I yeah, fucked it. Sure fucked it. I sure fucked it. I sure fucked it. Uh it's still going Maybe strong this is what's though. Supposed to happen. Yeah, I don't think I was supposed to make that jump right. Probably not. 
up here. Okay. See, mouse and keyboard, man. You gotta get used to them. <laughs> That's what we have you for. I guess. Uh, I dig the music. Uh, I guess this way? Just go that way, yep. Yeah, we're just going this way. She Fuck just it. pops around the corner and kills you. Uh, venting? Are we gonna see music, man? <laughs> uh, I'm the imposter. Left? Uh, yep, yep, yep. You got it, you got it. Left, Left. again. That's an optical illusion. Uh, yeah, a little bit, a little it made bit. Made it seem a lot deeper than it was going to be. Um, I think this is the end. Oh, there you are, buddy. Hi, how's it been? Don't worry. I am stabbed. Come on in, you stabbed. <laughs> uh, fucking. Oh shit. Oh my. Oh shit. Oh my god. How? What? How? She's got blood. She's organic. We know that much. Okay, okay. I can see in your facial tracking that you're scary, scary, upset. Transparency is an important part of our policy here at Indigo Park, so I need to be honest about something. The park has been inactive for years. Employees stop showing up, guests too, the mascots are... I just was so excited to see a visitor and I wanted to be sure you were given the best experience possible. Were you? I was confined to the entrance for so long, I didn't realize just how much disrepair the park has fallen into. I'm wasting all of your fun. Sorry for the inconvenience. I love the little snackle to but, he's got. But I have an idea. I have access to the repair documentation in my database. I just can't execute most tasks without authorization from a human user. You that sounds like a trap. The park right? Too, right? Would you be willing I think to help me restore guy. the park? I can see in your facial tracking data that you aren't opposed to this. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. God Let's damn it, if he wasn't the cutest little business. fucker though. Right? I think uh, he's the good guy. I don't. I really don't. I'm torn. Not after this. I think the... Okay, welcome oh. to the crew, Rookie Wrangler. Register. Your first Register. official job as one of Rambly's Wranglers Register. is to get out of the <laughs> Rambly's Wranglers Register room. <laughs> Head left towards the Rookie Wrangler Register. Security room to set yourself free. <laughs> Phew, kind of exhausting to say that whole spiel. But Rambly's Wranglers Register is a registered trademark. <laughs> That expired yesterday. Expired yesterday? Huh. That's <clears throat> interesting. Oddly... Oddly specific timing, right? Yes. Like, why are we in this park the day after the trademark expires? Are we trying to cover something up, maybe? Could be. No, nah, it's not something I can pick up, I guess. Okay. Uh, Jetstream Junction. Can I pick you up? Are you? We already have a lion plush. We do, I guess, huh? Employee. Uh, well, is there rangers else only. The hallway? We can go into the rangers' rooms now, right? Well, yeah, but was there anything else down the hallway? Oh shit! Damn it! You're right. Yeah, you're fine. Yeah, but there might have been like an arcade machine. Those seem important, frankly. Yep. Ooh, Cam was. Uh. I wonder if we'll see anyone else moving around. That's actually a good point. I'm kind of looking for like. Movement. Well, we know it's not the bird. The bird's dead. Yeah, I'm looking for Lion. Yeah, I think Lion's gonna be... If if there's a Chapter 2, I think he'll be the Chapter 2 boss. He'll be the ta Chapter 2 chase or boss. I'm hoping for more boss-like battles, like what we got with Catnap, you know? Cause, or something along those lines. Like how in FNAF there was at least minigame-esque aspects and it wasn't just all chase scenes. Uh, ooh. Oh. Oh. <laughs> My bad. I thought that um, was the game doing it, and I'm like, uh. Um, no, what I'm hoping for is using a ride to kill a thing, you know? Mm -hmm. Like, like going on a roller coaster or something, you, I don't know, Buzz Lightyear, Star Command style, shooting, shooting out stuff, and by shooting out the stuff, you obstruct the thing from attacking you. This is like where the Jungle Cruise and Indiana Jones are. This is uh, Adventureland, yeah. Oceanic Odyssey. Quick pass, stand by. This is a big chapter one. It's pretty yeah, big. I think we're Oceanic pretty Odyssey. much at the end, though. You're doing a great job, Rookie Wrangler. Thank you. Um, I appreciate that. Uh, Are we at the end of chapter one? I think we're pretty close. We just killed no, the boss. Oh, hurry up. Orpuses, pickles, and perches as far as the eye can see. 
doubtful. Please don't tap the glass. Never really know what to tap the glass. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, what it's the him. fuck? That's the guy. He's real? Eeyore. Hey, buddy. Told you. Okay. You look kind of tired. Is that another thing for... Don't worry, it's fine. I don't blame you for taking a rest after all that. I could go for a nice, relaxing defragmentation myself. But before you settle down, you up for a little survey to help us improve the park? Thanks for visiting Indigo Park. Hope all your dreams came true. If you've got some time and you're up for a lark, stick around for the Rambly Review. I'm here to offer my best to each valuable guest I assist. And lots of happy feedback ensures I get to exist. Were you satisfied? Does he die? No? If people don't like him? Your guide? Sure so. Do you plan to come back? Will I see you again? Did your experience you I'm now? so fucking into this right now. Right? Did I earn your trust? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> there is a stark contrast to everything I know this place should be. But out of the dark, you've given a spark of sunshine to this kingdom's faithful devotee at Indigo Park. I love this. Look at all those guys. 2D animation director. They did the fucking most when it came to Rambly himself. Nice. That is if you want to keep going. Oh, idea! I know all of this is The tunnel collapsed behind me. I can't go anywhere else. But here comes Rambly Review Part 2 to sell you on our task. I'm here to view and assess each valuable guest as I <laughs> As soon as they get to quality assurance, it starts speeding up. <laughs> Patreon supporters. Oh my god, that's a lot of Patreon supporters. I'm so happy to be your guy. So come back anytime. I'd love to see you again in all my Oh, they add you at the bottom of the special thing. Aww. At least I hope I do. I like their names unique. Indigo Park. There is a stark contrast to everything I know this place should be. But out of the dark, you've given a spark of sunshine to this kingdom. That was actually a really small team as well. Mm -hmm. Like, I look forward to chapter two of this. Forge fucking sure. And also, thank you to the songs that gave us enough for an episode. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, straight up. And, I mean, we're still going to have a small discussion after this about, like, what we think, uh, uh, theories as, as well, you know? He's, he is definitely the good guy in my opinion. I think so, too. The uh, villain in the game that we played is the one who's causing all this. Why would he feel left behind? Because all of his friends were turned bad by the poison. Hmm... I don't think he's the bad guy. I 100% think he's the bad guy. Why would he be the bad guy? It's a bendy situation, in my opinion. Full on passion part we've been working on a little over a year now. The stories we told over Craig Ramblin and his friends are very special to us. This game, we're going to need some help. If you enjoy the experience, check out search for our social if you want chapter two. Check out our channel. I gotta go main menu for now. Well, you know what? Fuck it. Might as well give him a shout out for yeah. what that's worth. I mean, here's Streamlabs. I announced Indigo Park, my Hello? Own indie horror game. Indigo Park is a game where Did you it open in the browser? It must have. And meet the Hold park's on. AI assistant, Randy What the fuck? Raccoon. We announced the game with a short trailer showing off the logo, Be big. the environment, and a beautiful animation. Uh, by ah! So bright. But I got a lot of questions. Thank you. Okay, so... Go give them a follow. Give them support if you like this game. So this is Unique Geese. I do know about Unique Geese. He's a... Very popular streamer and obviously a YouTube creator as well. And he got really into like FNAF, Bendy, Poppy, all that kind of shit. And he was like, I want to make one of that. And so he came out and he made Indigo Park with a with a small team of developers. And they did a, for, for that small of a team especially, fucking bravo. Like, yeah, it could use optimization. But like, other than that, uh, fucking whatever. They also, made a fantastic like introductory introductory chapter. Now knowing that the settings were, it's more lacking some controller support than it being the settings being weird, mm -hmm. I rescind my critique. 
Yeah, yeah. And I mean, hey, with the amount of support that this game is getting now because it blew the fuck up, yeah. um, they'll probably be able to, um, you know, optimize a little bit better, expand Future their team. Link Unique Geese's channel in, in the description. I will try. I'll try and remember to do that. Um, because Future Bends, I really do it now. It. Yeah, well, I can't. I'm editing the video right now. <laughs> Make mean, a note. That's me to remind you. Okay, fair enough. Um, but let's talk about the game itself, shall we? Yeah. Forrest, you're the only one who didn't touch it, so I think you review first. I'll just well, leave it I on here. I can't review the actual gameplay since, as you mentioned, I didn't touch it. Well, I mean, you got to see the gameplay. What did you think in general? Like, in terms of, I don't know, puzzles or walking around or whatever. Like, whatever. It's only chapter one, so please don't hate on me for this. But it was kind of lackluster. Ah, uh, fair enough. I think Poppy was a little lackluster in Chapter 1, too, for the it most was, part, too. It was, So, yeah. And that's, that's a fair critique, you know? Lackluster, but the, has potential. The story, however, has a lot more potential than Poppy Playtime. True. I'd actually agree. What I'm wondering, what I'm hoping for, I guess, is some of those unique puzzle mechanics, like what Poppy has. Because, um, like, the power puzzles in Poppy are really interesting and fun to go through. They get a little repetitive. They can get a little repetitive, but they find ways of changing them up slightly. Yeah. You know, like from chapter one, it was just wrap arm around thing, put in thing. And yeah, then by so, chapter so three, Pop it's... Poppy had better gameplay. Yeah. Thanks. But this has better story. Think so? I can already see the end of it. But mm. yeah. I... I don't think you can. This is a mascot horror, which means that there are many twists and turns in front of us, I think. Um, but I I do see where you're coming from on that one. Yeah. Like, I do really like these characters, and I think I just like I them wonder, more than What the hobbies. fuck are they made of? Right? Because, like, all other mascot horrors... Well, Mommy had blood in her. Mommy did have blood, didn't she? Um, when she got grinded. She got grinded up and she had blood. But that's different because she was originally plastic and toy and then, you know, human parts got shoved in. That what felt different. That felt like a full human, live human body being... So my the theory that Game Theory proposed is that they are actual animals that were experimented on and made into these mascots. That's why, you know, the lion acts like a lion instead of like a human who's just in a lion costume. And the bird did not act like a bird. Well, I don't know. She have waddled you, like one. Have you been around an ostrich? <laughs> that wasn't an ostrich. No, I know, but with how hyper-aggressive they are, <laughs> depending on what this stuff does to them. I mean, she is a macaw, um, but also... No wing flapping at all. There is uh, one thing... when they attack. That's true. There is one thing that we know for sure, and that's that they are not animatronics like snakes. Yeah, you know, correct. They are Which I find so fascinating. Or organic. Um, and while we didn't... Well, actually, maybe we did. I feel like we heard her speak when she killed us the two times, that, or three times that she did. Wait, yeah, actually. you guys were kind of loudly panicking. Yeah, sorry about that. But I think I heard her trying to say something, and I'm I missed I'm pretty sure it. I heard so, too. So, yeah. and the weird thing is, is like, you know that little death screen where it's like, Molly can repeat whatever she's heard before. Um, I wonder if that factors into it because like it's, maybe it's like what her past victim said or like a lore hint or something or if it if it is like maybe a scientist what a scientist said to her or something like that or staff yeah you know? um, like what a good bird yeah something like that um, but yeah so that's Indigo Park um, definitely go give con love to the content creator because I really want a chapter two Mr. Geese <laughs> Mr. Geese. That's why the bird's up front. Is it Ultra Geese? Unique Geese. It's Unique on the bottom geese. of the fucking screen. Well, thank you. Well, it was. It well, I'm sorry. All right. Well, let's do an outro then. This Justin, you're just in time to give some love to the creator of this game. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Otherwise, the next automated door that closes downward will close on your neck. Ooh. 
I haven't encountered many of those, but I'm sure I will sometime in my life. Hey, it happens in Final Destination movies. It can happen. It happens all the time in Final Destination. Fucking elevators, uh, just doors in general. Uh, the sunroof in a car while she's in a uh, car wash. Oh, I forgot about that one. Yeah. I, yeah. I've only watched four, so like, but uh, I have seen all the deaths. I mean, yeah. who hasn't? Anyway, we'll see everybody in the next one. Uh, Bye. See ya. <laughs>